I'm back and I'm here to stay. Hey y'all, uh, I'm going to get my walk, my walks. I'm gonna get my watch tightened, the one I got on Amazon. I didn't even eat anything today, I'm ar and I'm already, oh shoot, it's my turn. Miss my turn talking too much. <sighs> I get my hair done on Sunday. I'm so excited, y'all, I'm so excited. I haven't gotten a haircut in about a year, but I think I'm gonna get like round layers. Like I've looked on Pinterest and I really want like tape, like the tapered layer look since I like doing blowouts. And I feel like my hair just looks kind of flat. So I need some more um, shape to it. And I need some like face framing layers because. Yeah, bitch ass, you was about to get in front of me, dummy. Like what? I'm good, I'm good. All right, I'll be back. But yeah, we back at business. <laughs> Remember when Tokyo Tony was like, yeah, y'all can keep the trash. <laughs> I'm about to get my lashes done. I actually really like the natural sets on me, but I feel like the volume is like, it makes more sense so I don't have to like keep getting more fill in because the volume sets last longer and um, I just feel like the volume sets eventually turn into a classic set so it makes more sense to get volume right and I love volume lashes so um, yeah I'm excited to get my volume back mm, I think I'm gonna walk in right now I'm a little bit early but I have to pee so I got my lashes done the volume is back these lashes are literally gonna last like a month and I also got my nails done I feel like this nail is a little bit crooked but I got a package. It is literally so heavy, which is kind of making me nervous. This looks very intimidating. It's actually going pretty well. Everything has a letter, so it's pretty simple. Let me not speak too soon though. I'm officially done. It wasn't that bad. But um, let me show you guys. Um, yeah, it looks pretty nice. I'm gonna put some catnip in it so she can like investigate it. But yeah, I like it. Tomorrow morning is my hair appointment. 
I am so excited, y'all. I'm going to bed at 10.30. It's 10.30 and I'm about to go to bed. I'm going to wake up early. I'm going to get a coffee. I'm going to do my makeup. I'm going to put on a cute outfit. Get my hair done. Nails done. Lashes done. <laughs> and then I'm going to go to New York on Tuesday. And then I'm going to go thrifting with Kayla after I get my hair done. Like right after. Because my hair salon and the thrifting place are like next door. And luckily my best friend lives like 10 minutes away from all of that. So we're going thrifting and we're going to make a day of it. Today is the day I just did my makeup. Oh, shit. I don't know my face gets always gets itchy when I'm done. Okay. Now I'm going to pick out my outfit and we're going to hit the streets. So this is the fit. Um, these girlfriend jeans. This shirt I just got from Abercrombie. And my New Balances I just got from the Super Bowl, from winning the Super Bowl. My room is a mess right now, so don't mind that, but I'm feeling this outfit. I feel like I, feel like I look like a cool girl, you know? Ew. I'm not going to record in the car until I get... Is it focused? until I get a new car mount because this is not it's not working because I was watching my videos back and like it, it's like kind of shaky and it was giving me a headache so I need to get one of those expensive car mounts but um I'm about to look up the studio I have not eaten anything let me go ahead and drink my water because whenever I like drink coffee on an empty stomach it literally fucks up my stomach. The only thing about Dunkin' and these cafes is cafes always have the worst food. Starbucks and Dunkin', they both, like, the food is ass. I hate it. If you really want to go get some good, fast breakfast, go to McDonald's and get you a McGriddle. But sometimes coffee is more important, so you gotta make the sacrifice. Thank you, honey, for Hi, um, can I have a small, hot, caramel craze signature latte with oat milk? Small, hot, caramel craze, anything else? With oat milk, right? Yes. Okay. And can I get a banana chocolate chip bread? So we actually don't have any at the moment. We are getting some tomorrow. Okay. Um, could I have some bagel bites? Plain everything. Plain. Anything else? That's it. See, I don't know. Thank you. I just parked. I am here. I pray my car does not get broken into. I'm from this area. I'm from East Atlanta, but this is like the gentrified part. Oh. Because there were the spots were filled up, so I had to park in this abandoned place. I literally hate walking in the street. It's so embarrassing for some reason. So I'm taking out. So I'm taking out with me. I have to walk like a whole block. This is so ghetto in East Atlanta. See, you already hear the sirens. Already, already cutting up. But my fit is so cute. That's the studio creature. Tell me what you say, come again. If you cannot stay down, then you do not have to pretend. Like there is no way out. I should have never let you in. Cause you got me face down. And don't take this personal.
Bitch, my hair looks so good. Look at the. This was the right decision. Let me cross this fucking street so I can show y'all for real. Bitch, look. I should have got these shorter, but like I didn't know how it looked curly. So she did her damn thing. Oh, like it gives so much body. Like layers actually make your hair look longer. This bitch. She did her damn thing. Because <sighs> I'm trying. Hello? Are you ready? Yeah, basically. Basically, what do you have to do? Um, put my socks on. All right, well, I'm, I'm headed to your apartment, right? Yeah. All right, well, I'm about to head there now. Okay, why are you sound so frantic? Because I felt like you're about to be like, oh, no, I need an hour to get ready. You know how you do. But I'm out of breath. That's why. <laughs> are you hungry? Yes, Kayla, we are going out to eat. Girl, bitch, let me tell you something. <laughs> yeah, I basically starved myself just so we can go. Oh, good, thank you. Because you know you don't be eating. Girl, bye. I'm with my bitch, Kayla. And she's she's getting herself ready. What is that? Look at her, she looks so cute. I didn't know you had dimples. Bitch. Yeah, good thing, right? We're doing a little um, thrifting haul. You started it already? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> That's why I don't make no videos with her. She gave me two books. I'm keeping my notes Two to books. myself. Two books to read. I'm oh, gonna give her the review. She already read these. Yes. <laughs> Thank you for the confirmation. Today I got this bag. Really cute. It was $40. I think it was worth it. So, you, you showed your purse. Oh, it already went, like, yeah. some restart? Hey. hey. Let, me see, let me see your earrings. Okay, so I got this purse. A little tote bag, a little tote moment. Yes, and it was $45. Cute little matcha color. I think it's on Amazon for 15, but it's fine. <laughs> then I got these heart, these um bow shaped earrings. This is actually really cute. Do a little close up. Okay, sorry. Here, but I got heart earring, heart earrings. <laughs> these are actually really cute for her little like second hole. Yeah, yeah. And that's it for me. Show the ring. Oh, and then I got. To go with my bestie ring. With my bestie. Yeah, we got bestie rings. So, let, let's see what I got. Okay. I'm going to New York, and I've always wanted a furry hat, and I found one. So she can stop wearing that one hat. I look like Abraham Lincoln. Yeah, well, like This that. is cute. That's cute, yeah. It's giving, like, rich mafia. See? Look at this necklace I got. That is really cute. Is cute yeah. And these are cute, too. It's like a safety pin with little stars on it. Thank you. Thank you. And I got these. They're like little bubbles. And some little square hoops. Even though I have all of this saved on Amazon. And she got two books for me. I already said that. Oh. Yeah. An African... American. <laughs> it's an American marriage. <laughs> I'm not saying an African American marriage. That's racist. <laughs> the book of... <laughs> I thought you were gonna say it. The Book of the Lights with a note for her. Yeah. So that's my bitch. It's the next day. Um, I'm wearing the same clothes because I spent the night at Kayla's house. It was just too much going on last night. But I got my phone back. Got Chick fil A breakfast. I always get the chicken minis and hash browns. When I say I got this every single day in high school, I mean every single day. I always put, I always like to put honey on each bite I get because I'm greedy. Oh, and I got a frosted coffee. I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys want explanation from last night about just regular, let me go through your phone stuff. Like, but I am single.
Uh, that's for sure. I am definitely single. I'm not going to air out all my business on that relationship. I'm just going to say that like sometimes there just comes a time where you know that the relationship isn't good for any of you guys anymore. It's whatever. Live and learn. I'm just glad I have such thick skin now because y'all saw how I reacted with my last breakup. I was literally in shambles, but now I'm like, life goes on and God, God's got me. I'm getting ready to go pick up Alessandra from school. Um, if you don't know, if you don't follow me on TikTok or don't know who Alessandra is, that's my little sister. She's the one I travel with. Um, she's about 16. She gets on my nerves, but I love her. That's my, that's my dog. So I'm going to go pick her up and maybe, maybe take her to Target to buy her something. But I'm just picking out my, um, perfume for the day. Hmm. I think I might, I think I might wear YSL Libre. If it doesn't smell good, she will tell me. I really like this Sol Janeiro. That's how you say it in Portuguese. Deodorant. It's the... I don't know which one. The pink one. I think I might wear my Madewell glasses that I got in New York. They're like a little... They're red. So she can see everybody got a cool sister. What's up? I'm doing a YouTube vlog. Yeah, that's why I stopped talking. <laughs> why? <laughs> like, this is unnatural. Look, at, she looks so cute. Look, mm -hmm. she looks like a little um, alternative. Does it look like I have false lashes? It actually does. You look like a little... um. It's my mascara. You, if uh, you want... If I don't you know want, how to describe <laughs> this. Freaky Friday? It's cute, though. It's cute. Let's turn the camera around. <laughs> These square glasses <laughs> not giving me back. <laughs> yeah, I saw these in the church before. Somebody's auntie has these. Okay. Oh, okay. Cut the cameras. <laughs> Why? <laughs> okay. Anyways, let's continue our conversation like usual. Okay, go By ahead. By the way, I have an idea for TikTok that I want to do. I want to you know you know that sounds like right. I have a platform, right. I just need a thing. Right. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay, yes, yes. <laughs> What? <laughs> Why? Just tell me. I want you. I want you to be the one that say right. You got it. <laughs> like, what is the idea? I will show you when I'm done. Oh yeah, that was that was a good one. That was a good pitch. <laughs> yeah. No, I really want to do it. Don't piss me off ever again. I made a mistake and I took her to Target, and she was just talking about. We just went thrifting and she already already needs um what? I don't need anything. I just want it. Exactly. <laughs> Exactly. Actually, I did not plan on shopping, but with Alessandra, you're gonna spend some money. She's not cheap. So let's see what I got. So we went to Second Street. I think that's what you call it. It's a thrifting place. Urban Outfitters and Target. So from Urban Outfitters, I got, let's see. This really cute, it's like a little track jacket. It is so cute. Like, um, it matches it matches my red glasses and it looks really cute with low-waisted jeans, so. And from Second Street, I got this really cute hoodie. I'm definitely gonna wear this in LA. I'm about to wash that because my flight is tomorrow morning. And from Target, I got this bag my only black bag is like gold and it's like an envelope bag and i can't wear that like with a street outfit so i had to get this one and it's like i feel like this is more casual it's giving mark jacobs and it has like a lot of storage in here so i think this is gonna be my travel purse because black matches everything i also got my cellar water because lately I've been using that reusable makeup remover cloth and it works, but um, I miss using actual makeup remover. Um, last two things, a uh, hand sanitizer for my purse and the airport and this cute little, um, this was $17, but I really had to try it y'all. I'm sorry. Um, and it's like really pretty. Look. 
it's like the um thing is like see-through you see that let's try it on oh it smells so good oh my gosh wait this was actually wait no way i thought this was just gonna be like clear mm, it smells good all right now i'm going to go pack for my trip see y'all tomorrow morning peace out It feels so good brushing my hair with this because it's so gentle. The curls turned out really cute, I'm not gonna lie. Something I do with this is I brush it back. My hair is straight, I brush it back. I put some um, dry shampoo in it last night so it could have some volume. And then I Put my middle part back put my middle part back in and it's like it adds volume kind of see it's 4 37 so let me call my uber now okay i really need to get to the airport at five because my plane because i take off at 7 30 so which means boarding is like at 6 30. time management skills are a1 when it comes to traveling Ah, I, I landed like, um, uh, like two hours ago, I think. Um, me and my mom are going to like this observatory, you know, like that glass thing that has the glass, um, floors. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to go there. <laughs> Nah, I'm, I'm headed.
still in LA. My mom had to go back to work. Um, I wanted to stay a little bit longer, so I booked a new hotel for myself. I left my toothbrush and toothpaste at the hotel I was staying with with my mom. So I just ordered some stuff off Uber Eats and it literally came as soon as I came to the hotel. But right now I'm getting ready to meet my friend. Um, I actually met her on TikTok and we met for the first time while she was traveling to St. Martin. So we hung out in St. Martin. So um, this is my first time meeting her where she lives. So we're gonna go get some dinner. Um, I'm really excited, but I'm excited for tomorrow. I get a full day in LA by myself for the first time. I'm gonna probably hang out with my other friend. Um, it's not like that, but still, I'm excited. My plane, my plane was delayed, so we were only in New York for a few hours, but it was still really fun. We went to the edge and um, we saw like the whole city from up there. And what else did we do? We went to this really nice Italian restaurant, homemade everything, so good. And um, what else? It was raining, but it, but I still had a really good day. And today went really well. Um, me and my mom booked like a little celebrity house tour. So we went through Beverly Hills and saw the celebrity houses and everything. It was really inspiring. I was like, damn, people actually live like this? Basically ready. I've been wearing this outfit all day. I just have to touch up my makeup a little bit because my, hold on, someone's calling me. Good morning. Um, I got my favorite egg slut. I've been waiting, I've been waiting so long to eat this again. Last night was pretty fun. I forgot to bring my camera though. Ugh. But it was such a pretty place. We went to Laurel Hardware. Um, and I liked the food, but I ordered this squash pizza. It was not good. But I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna complain. Look. Ooh, I got my truffle tater tots, not tater tots, um, hash browns. Mmm. Look at that. Wait, can you focus? I met the cutest Italian man. He had to be like mid 40s. Actually, probably early 50s. So fine. He was all over me. He was making fun of my squash pizza because he's like a real Italian. Um, I gave him my number, but I don't think he typed it in right. He was a little bit drunk. But he was with a group of people. They were all so cool. We stood. Me and my friend talked to them for like a while. I gave the girl asked for my Instagram. Gave it to her. She didn't follow me because she was again. They were drunk. Okay. I got uh. What did I get? I forgot what this called. Hmm. I just got back from shopping. Can't wait to show you guys a little haul of what I got. Let's get into this chill little um, shopping fit I have on. I love it. I love a boring fit. I thrive in basicness. Um, new bounces. Okay. A little bit of booty bag there. But this is Naked Wardrobe and the shirt is Free People. So this is the first thing. It's like a little sweatsuit. This is killing me right now, I'm not gonna lie. This looked a lot better. Why do why does stuff always look better in store dressing rooms? What's the science behind that? Because it did not look like this. And these are my favorite tank tops ever. I already have one in white, but um, I need one in gray because I really like these tank tops. And my sister so lovingly told me that I don't look good in high-waisted jeans. So I've been trying to accumulate low-waisted jeans. I only have like one pair. So I got these i also got this shirt a lot of you guys won't like this but you have to see the vision like imagine pairing this with some gold jewelry some jean shorts tan sandals like preferably hermes sandals but i don't have them so we're gonna have to sign on and i got this luxurious silk pajama set i think these are leopards um this might be the cutest pajama set i have ever owned they look like hearts they're so cute I'm really just not getting into jewelry. Like if you 
watched my past videos, you'll see that I rarely wear jewelry. Um, earrings at most. Maybe a necklace. Uh, I'm not feeling the heart shape. I thought these would be like, I don't know why they're like hanging like that. I thought they would be, I don't like this, no. I wanted like a, some chunky gold, you know what I'm talking about. And I also got two things from Sephora. I got this um, Kayali, Kaylee, but this was a blind buy, but this was the last bottle there. So I'm like, this probably smells good cause it's almost sold out. I'm really nervous. It's actually really good. Mmm, very mature, but sexy. Finally able to get my hands on some Summer Fridays lip balm. This is in the shade Vanilla Beige. I didn't want to get like a clear one cause I'm like, I have so many clear lip glosses. Let me just, let me make this one count. Mmm. Sorry I'm moaning, but I really, really like this applicator because it kind of like hugs my lips. What are we thinking? Y'all know I hate color on my lips, but I like this. I got, I got Annie's Soul Delicious. I really wanted in and out but they don't deliver. Oh, that's crazy. I should not be eating this on the bed. I got some wings. I forgot. I think this is like hot honey or something like that. This is probably the best wing I have ever had in my life. Hey y'all, I'm back in Atlanta. Sorry I didn't record the rest of my trip. The only thing I didn't record was that dinner with my friend, but that was my first time meeting that person in person. I've known them for like a year and a half, but that was my first time meeting them in person. And I didn't want to bring my camera out, you know. You know. But remember when I was in showing y'all my haul and I was like, this would look cute with some Hermes slides. I just don't have them. Who don't have them? Who don't have them? Okay, these were a gift from somebody I went to dinner with. Not from LA, but literally like a couple days ago. I went to dinner and I was gifted this. Y'all wanna see? Where we where we at this summer? Outside. But anyways, thank you for welcoming me with open arms back to YouTube. Um, I'm really excited to be back. I'm like just now getting in the swing of editing and stuff, so this vlog might be a little boring. I'm just getting used to like recording everything again with my camera and also making TikToks. I've always wanted to be a YouTuber. And um, it's no time, it's, it's no better time to start than now. And um, I'm just excited to get the ball rolling. Mm, and I'm just excited for like this to be second nature for me when it comes to editing and like being more comfortable with recording in public. Cause as y'all can see, like I didn't really record too much. I feel like when certain people leave your life it makes room for better things. And like you start to see it immediately. You are not getting any younger. You cannot waste your time on nobody. I've learned this. One thing I've learned while dating, if he isn't actually making your life better, y'all should not be dating. He's literally just a friend. Um, I looking back, I don't think I've ever dated somebody that actually made my life better. I the love the love was there. But did they actually make my life better? No. Did they actually contribute something to my mental health? No. I see a lot of videos on TikTok saying where to find high value men, blah blah blah, go to country clubs, go to um you know, these events, I want to be in those events for myself. I want to be invited to those events. You know, I want to be the rich man. So uh, I think once I get to that point, I'm going to be like, you know, the standards are going to be so high. Like, I'm not going to be putting up with nothing. 
when you can when you pour into yourself the stuff that these boys have to offer just seems so like and i would like you guys to witness this whole journey because um i'm not getting any younger and this is my chance to pour into myself god has shown me so many signs leave him bella leave him bella you need to be single bella but i learned the hard way because i wasn't listening but but hey i'm single now to be honest i've never been single isn't that crazy i've never been single not even in high school i've always had somebody and honestly it wasn't really like my choice it's just like i'm just a flirtatious person and I just be flirting my way into relationships. It's nothing more to, it's like, and it's literally just a matter of me setting boundaries and be like, hey, let's stop here. Cause I, I just wanted to flirt. I just want to hang out. I just want to have fun. I didn't want to, you know, I don't want to check in with you every day. I don't want, no, I don't need, I don't need none of that. I don't need none of that. I'm a Sagittarius. I can't be, I want you to want me. And I want all that, but I don't want to be tied down. Okay, I can't. It's not in my nature. Not right now, at least. But I'm still going to be going on dates and stuff. Y'all know me. I just like to date. I like to flirt, okay? I like to be wined and dined. Um, and I'm going to tell y'all all about it. But anyways, I love y'all. I see y'all's comments reminding me that I need to make my YouTube. And uh, I listened. And I really, really, really appreciate you guys like hounding me about my YouTube. Um, but this this YouTube is gonna be a little bit different. I'm rebranding the whole thing. I have a new intro, new outro. If y'all watch my old YouTube videos, it was just me being the stay at home girlfriend that y'all hate. But yeah, bitch, I'm back and I'm better than ever. But yeah, put your seatbelts on. Cause this is going to be a very fun ride. Love you.